Welcome to Lesson 5 in Unit 18, The Power of Water. In this lesson, students will work to answer the question, how does the Glen Canyon Dam impact the environment? In this lesson, students investigate how adding the dam to the Canyon River can impact habitats and alter the rate of erosion in the area. Students will explore how the dam affected the habitat of the razorback suckerfish and how scientists are using technology to counteract the impact on the fish. They figure out that building the dam on the river changes the rate of erosion and causes damage to habitats, including the razorback suckerfish. Students learn scientists are using technology to grow and return fish to the river to counteract the effects of the dam. Students make connections to the storyline by explaining that the dam damages habitats and harms wildlife like the razorback suckerfish, which is a reason people might want to remove it. There are several opportunities for ELA and social studies cross-curricular connections throughout the lesson. You can look for specific standard connections in the Unit 18 Teacher Guide. This lesson will take approximately five days to complete. For the Engage portion, you'll show students the Razorback Suckerfish video and images to introduce this species that has become endangered since the building of the Glen Canyon Dam. You'll ask questions about the interactions between the razorback suckerfish, its environment, and the organisms within. During the discussion, you can post and discuss the endangered species and extinct vocabulary cards. You'll revisit the driving question board and highlight questions connected to the learning goals of this lesson by calling attention to questions about how the dam might impact the natural processes of erosion in the river the river habitats, or how the dam harms the river. For the Explore portion, you'll review the demonstration procedure and guide questions for the model of the dam, found in the Lesson 5 Dam Model Procedure. You'll have the class observe as you demonstrate the impact of the dam. Be sure to see the link to a tutorial for this investigation in the Teacher Guide. You'll have students use the Dam Model Student Journal pages to record their observations in the table as you conduct the demonstration. In the Explain portion of the lesson, students will engage in a class discussion about their observations and learning from the activity. Use the provided questions to guide your discussion around the question, How does the Glen Canyon Dam impact the environment? The goal of this class discussion is to analyze student observations and identify how placing a dam in a river can impact the environment and specifically the habitat of the razorback suckerfish. You will use the discussion to create the Lesson 5 summary chart. From the discussion, students should understand that the Glen Canyon Dam is built on the Colorado River and has damaged many habitats, including the razorback suckerfish. This lesson connects to the controversy because it shows how the dam harms habitats in the canyon area, which is a reason some people do not want the dam. For the elaborate portion, you'll ask students how they think what they've learned in this lesson connects to the Glen Canyon controversy. You'll share with students a video about the efforts to restore the fish population in the Colorado River. For the evaluate portion, you'll have students answer questions 2 and 3 in the DAM model student journal pages. You'll then have students revisit their public service announcement planner student journal page. To support student sense making across the unit, orient them back to the driving question board. Ask, what questions did we answer about how the Glen Canyon Dam impacts the environment? And what new questions do we have? By the end of this lesson, students will have carried out investigations and made observations about how the use of the dam causes changes to the rate of erosion affecting habitats, obtained, evaluated, and combined information to learn how scientists are using technology to mediate habitat loss caused by the dam. In Lesson 6, students will consider how humans used Glen Canyon before the dam was built and why that might be important. For more information about this unit, visit mysidepartners.com.